Hello guys, welcome back to TechDose and in this video we will see the autocomplete feature using try. So in this problem I will be using this try node which will contain a variable data of type character and then I will have 26 pointers assuming that all the characters will be either in lower case or in upper case and not in a mixed cases. So this is the node structure where we will have a character data and then we will have an array of pointers which will be having 26 pointers in an array. So let us look at the problem statement. Whenever we type some words or sentences then the machine stores those words and sentences in its database and then when we again type similar type of words or matching prefixes then it tries to recommend so that we don't have to type it again. So that feature is known as autocomplete so that when we type some prefix then the entire sentence or the entire word comes out so that we can just select those sentence or the word and then we don't have to write the entire word now how do we implement it using try now suppose we have already entered these words and then we want to type some other word let's say we just type a then what will be the predictions in this case I will assume that the suggestions which the machine will make will be alphabetically sorted. Now when I type this letter A then the suggestion will be ABB if I consider the top one word. But if I consider top two words then the suggestion will be ABC according to the alphabetically sorted order. And since these are the words which we had already entered so the machine knows that these words exist in the database. So how to implement it? Let us just simply make a try and then we will see how these features are being implemented. So I have already made a separate video on try insertion and here I will quickly flow through the insertion part and if you don't understand then please refer to my try insertion video. So try always has a root and then from there I will insert this first word which is A, B and C. So these are the words and actually in the try structure I forgot to uh, take an integer word end value because this word end will keep track of which of the words has ended at what node. So this will also be included integer word end. So ABC has been inserted. A has word end value of 0. B has word end value of 0. C will have word end value of 1 because a word has ended at C. Now we insert ABD. A, B are already inserted so we will insert just D and here word and value will be 1. Now we insert A, B, B. A, B is already inserted so we will insert just B and here word and value will be 1. We insert A, B, D. A, B, D is already inserted so we will just increment the word and value. We will uh, insert this B, C, D. So B, C and D is inserted and here word and value will be 1. CD is inserted so this will be C, D and E and here word and value will be equals to 1. So we have made the complete try and all these nodes are having word and values of 0 since no words are ending at these nodes. So using this word and value actually our machine will come to know that what words are included and what words to suggest. Now let us assume that we are making top one suggestion that means our machine will suggest only the top word. Now make a guess here. If I type A then what will be the suggestion? Will it be AB or will it be ABB or will it be ABC or will it be ABD? From the try as you can see when we type A then after matching in this try we will be present at this node. From this node what will be the suggestion what do you think will be the suggestion well i when i have already assumed that the suggestions will be alphabetically sorted alphabetically sorted so as you can see clearly that when i traverse in a pre order fashion in a pre order manner from the given node a then what will be the first node where word and value will be greater than 0 from this a i'll flow to b B is having word and value of 0. So I, I won't do anything. I will go to this B. Now this B is having word and value of 1. So I will print the given path. Which will be ABB and no other word. So this will be the correct answer. 
and these all will be the wrong answers now if we type a b then what will be the suggestion now if we type a b then we will start from this root node we will flow to a b we will come to a b and this is the node we will be presently at this is the node which is denoting a b path now from this node what will be the next node which will be alphabetically sorted and where word and value will be greater than zero so i will start pre-order traversal from this node b and i will reach this b and this b is having a word and value greater than zero so our suggestion will be a b b okay now if i type a b c then what will be the suggestion first we will traverse this try we will reach to a b and b we are at this node now you can see that the word and value is already one and there are no child nodes therefore the suggestion will still be a b c now what if we extend this problem and then we say that we don't want just top one suggestion but now we want top three suggestions and then we type let's say a then what will be the outputs when we type a then we will be present at this node now we want to print the top three suggestions now we will traverse in the pre-order fashion and we will print the path to the first three nodes where word and value will be greater than zero so from here we will go to b we will go to this b this b is having word and value greater than zero so i will print this path which will be a b b now i will come back i will backtrack to this b and then i will come back to this c when i reach this c then you can see that here word and value is greater than zero so i will print this path which is a b c so the next word will be a b c now when i uh, go back from this c to b and again to d you can see that here word and value is greater than zero which is two and so i will print this path a b d so the next word will be a b d so these are the three suggestions which will be made if we consider this top three suggestions in alphabetically sorted order and when i type only a now let's assume that i insert a b i insert a b in this try then what will happen this word and value will be incremented to one because i will traverse from root to a from a to b and then here we are ending a word and therefore the word and value will be incremented by one value and it will be equals to one now if i again type a then what will be the top three suggestions now we will again do the pre-order traversal from this node a and i will print the path to the first three nodes where word and value is greater than zero in this case when i reach to b this b then the word end value is greater than zero so i will print this a b first so this a b will come first now we will go back to this b this b will come and so we will print a b b and the next one will be a b c so you can see that when you insert the words then in real time this try gets updated and so the suggestions will keep changing depending on the words you keep typing now what happens if you type a b c what will be the top three suggestions here in this case the top three suggestion will only be a single suggestion because when you type a b c then you will traverse in this try and you will reach this node b and since this b is a child so there is no other path or no other word which is having prefix as a b b so you have just a single word so the answer will only be a b c now if you type b then what will be the top three suggestion when you type b then starting from root you will go to b you are at this node b now you will follow a pre-order traversal from this node b such that the next three word and values wherever you find greater than zero you print the path to those nodes so you start from this b you reach c here word and value is equals to zero you won't do anything you will go to d here word and value is greater than one so you will print the path which is b c d so b c d will get printed now you will come back from d come back to c and then come back to b now you can see that you just found a single node but you were required to give the top three suggestions so your top three suggestions will only contain a single word 
because there is no other word in the database where the prefix starts with B other than this BCD. Now I hope I was able to make you clear how the autocomplete feature is implemented using try. So let us look at the time and space complexity analysis. So what will be the time complexity? So when you analyze the time complexity, then for insertion, you have two operations insertion into the try and then the query times. So the insertion time will be equals to order of number of words which gets inserted. Okay. And that will be multiplied with the maximum word length. So it also depends on the word length as well. And this will be the insertion time. Now, if you don't consider the real time learning of the machine, then we can add the querying time to it. Querying time as well. And querying time will be equal to this will be equals to uh, what will it will be it will be number of queries because in each query you will be actually writing a word or some letters so it will be number of queries multiplied by the maximum word length so that this will be it about the time complexity of insertion plus querying time and this will actually boil down to how many number of queries you have if you have lower number of queries as compared to number of words then the time will be equals to the insertion time but if you have number of queries as very high as compared to number of words and you are not considering real time machine learning then actually you will be having this time now let us look at the space complexity actually we made use of just a single try in order to store all the words so what will be the space complexity the space complexity will be order of number of words because each word will be stored in a try or if you are storing sentences then each sentence will be stored in a try into maximum word length because a word length will actually decide what will be the depth of this try so word length will decide the depth of try and the number of words can define what will be the width okay so since we are considering only uh, nodes from 0 to 25 that is from a to z so the width cannot be more than 26 uh, from a single node so these are the limitations and i hope you were able to understand it as usual the code will be present in the description section below so do check it out if you face any type of problem then do comment below and i'll try to help you as soon as possible like and share our video and subscribe to our channel in order to watch more of these programming videos see you on our next video thank you